Greetings, you stinky, stinky piggy, and welcome to the realm of wherever the hell we are playing as whoever the hell we are even. Uh, I haven't had much sleep, sorry. Uh, yesterday, we played as the first lady herself, uh, not like the president's wife, I mean like, uh, like the first lady of our dynasty, I don't remember her name, uh, D D Dharama Dora, uh, the whole point of this series, and... She died. Well, more specifically, we declared a war. We lost a war. We then declared the same war, won the war that we lost that we declared for, and then we died. Uh, something to do with a mangling, thanks to Typhus itself. A giant tick ripped our face clean off, and that was the end of us there, brother. So now we're playing as, you know it, Killer Karen herself. Nine years of age, hands like a boxer. Hands like Mike Tyson himself. You'll know what they call a Killer, killer, killer Karen. Good lord. Um, anyway, welcome back to Crusader Kings 3. Uh, we're trying to get a very difficult achievement on very few hours of sleep. Just puts all the extra kudos in it if I actually pull this off. Which, let's be reasonable, not off to the best. <laughs> Titular character died within the first episode. So really not doing super well on that front, I will admit. Um, and I've got my troops raised. What are they doing? Just hanging out. Oh, we're raiding. Um, we really haven't done much raiding in CK3. Uh, it's very similar to raiding in CK2, funnily enough. Um, it's very similar. In fact, you sit there, you raid, and then you walk away with so much gold. You realize you are bisexual. That really makes no difference. In fact, no, it's good because it means that now we've got a much more open field of seductions to play with. This is great. Doesn't matter our vassals. Uh, bear in mind that there's only female temple holders in this too. That's actually quite useful if you want the, the realm priest to endorse us. Good for future reference. Obviously, we can't do much with it right now. At least, I hope not. Uh, can't raid that one. Why? Where's the raid bar? Oh, that one's being raided. Sorry, my bad. Right, let's head over to you. There we are. Much better. We're not exactly making... Oh, well, admit, we're not breaking the bank here. 8 out of 68 gold. Not really fantastic, is it? Oh, I also think this is our stepfather. Uh, yeah, this is our, this is our mother's ex-husband. Um, he will definitely not hesitate to kill us dead for being within his realm um so we're gonna we're gonna run away oh god are we oh god <laughs> what is that move route we're gonna run away i'm gonna give him a very wide berth if possible um no 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 uh that's it give him a wide berth head up through here and let's see if we can get the remainder of our troops home before they all starve to death horribly right generous diligent or patient wow that's a tricky choice they're all really good um generous gives so what are we looking for here Learning education to get the wise woman trait, because that's really overpowered. Um, or it is quite powerful in this situation. I won't say really overpowered. Learning plus two with patient. Liege and vassal opinion plus five. Wow. Okay, give me that then. I'll take it. Oh, <laughs> eight gold and eight prestige in a claim. You don't say. You get... My God. Look, I know I've got a short memory, but I genuinely thought for a second that said you gained the trait pregnant. And uh, I had many a question for this video game. You're not betrothed, speaking of which. Uh, right, let's take a look then at alliance power. Do you want a panda? Um, just one panda or... Oh, okay. Oh, panda. Who else we got? Uh, we've got the chiefdom of I Ijor. Um, God damn, these troops... I'm, I'm, I don't know whether to go for alliance power. Bear in mind, it's not that important right now. Alternatively, it's also a cousin, so we got to watch out for that. Alternatively, we go for just purely inheritable traits and try and build up the dynasty early. Try and get something into our family tree. I'm going to go for that instead. We get possessed. Um, strangely enough, I think we, that's what we should go for here. We get the wise when we get possessed. Hey, it doesn't matter how shit our character is, but the realm is safe, and that's really what's important right now. Um, P-O-S-S. -S, there it is. Uh, top possessed, bottom possessed. It's always the top possessed, you idiot. Nobody. Damn it. Uh, okay, we'll go back for that guy who was genius, I believe. Um... Genius, genius, genius. Yeah, there was. Too ghoul. Uh, or not too ghoul. Well, he is 45, so that's a little bit strange. Um, what about you? Oh, you're only 12. Uh, which in this context is good. Yeah, I'm alright with that. Yeah, that's uh, that's fine. There's only a year difference between them. That's a good marriage. Oh my god, what have you done? Oh, it's matrilineal. <sighs> okay, I thought for a second I didn't hit the matrilineal button. We are above our domain limit by two. I'm just gonna hold on to it, and we're just gonna wait for our stewardship to tick up, and hopefully that'll be enough to to be able to hold those. I don't want to give them away and then find out we get, you know, two out of four when we actually come of age here. Um, right, you get to work. Uh, you get to work over there and we're just going to pray that that guy manages to pull that off because that's a, that's a shot in the dark right there. Greedy. Ah, uh, I see no downside to it. Besides the minus two diplomacy. Oh, well, I mean, it's quite literally a downside to it. Um, but in, in our context of the learning king, uh, learning queen, there's actually no real problem with that at all. What does this mean? Aaron married. Lovely Keith. 
Uh, how lovely are you, lovely Keith? You're actually quite good there, Keith. Um, she's, uh, Amazonian. Ooh, we could risk it. She's 36, so he's gonna have to, he's just gonna have to get on that fast. All right, got, I didn't mean that quite so literally, but I guess it works. Okay, good luck. Give, get some Amazonians into this family. <laughs> Marry off our father. You're getting married off for alliances. Oh, God, we can't. Um, Marry off our father. We're gonna marry him to this 44-year-old woman. Um, so that there can never be any threats to our realm. Can't create the duchy. Obviously can't afford it. Raiding's not really going to help out with that at all. We can seek the spirits. At the age of Babby. How old are we? 13. Um, excellent. Offer a grand of, of, what's a cowrie? Cowrie's fruit and myrrh. It's definitely take notice. It's a powerful spirit. 40 stress because we're greedy. Too late. Spirit time. Oh, God. Oh! Bush spirit's blessing. Oh, well, that's actually quite good. Marsh plus three, prowess plus four. Not massively as well. I would have preferred to have been, you know, possessed or strong like our mother was, but that's okay. <laughs> um, to the obnoxious killer Karen. We've been burdened by your oppressive laws for far too long. No more. We're done paying your taxes. Uh, never. Absolutely never. Hang on. Raise the troops first. Um, kind of preemptively. Never. And then kill them dead. Slay, the slay them dead. Kill them dead. Good work. Incredible war there from the peasants. Just phenomenal. Locals pacified. Killer Karen, she's earned her name. Actually, she's about to turn 16 as well. Um, September, come on. Oh my god, we didn't give her a guardian. Uh, a f fantastic start, genuinely, all around to this series. Uh, my brother Aaron Friend, you're actually a good Aaron, all right, educator. All right, go on then. Come on. Save, save it. Insightful thinker, what's that? Level two? Okay, you know what? I saved it. I saved it there. That could have ended disastrously, but it actually wasn't too terrible. We didn't really have anyone better to educate her anyway, so that's um, that's fine. It's not fine, is it? She's got 12 learning. Oh, Christ. This is a bad character, but it's still redeemable. Don't worry. We're not, we're not, you know, we're not, we're not game over in quite yet. Um, I'm just going to take anyone as consul so the game stops bothering me about it. Let's go on a long pilgrimage. Why not? Well, I've got a good idea. Why not? Because we're minus 31 in debt. We're trying to make a bloody duchy level title. No. No, I'm sorry. I can't afford it. Um, excellent work. Thank you. Glad to accept your marriage proposal to Swanky Steve. Excellent. My aunt? Oh, no. What have I done? Ah, we have a daughter. She's garbage. A regular or boring daughter. Um, I'm going to call you Boring Betty then. Sorry, Boring Betty. Uh... Get, how do you spell bet, bet, Betty? Be beat her? <laughs> I mean, that looks a little bit better. Oh, achievement unlocked. Marry another character. That was a hell of an achievement. Thank you. Although in this campaign, that is decently an achievement. Um, I think, I think, I think, get rid of the consorts uh, now that we're married. Quite simply because the husband is a genius and the more we're pregnant the less we can be get pregnant by him does that make sense um we've only got a quarter chance of the kid being his uh and, and i feel like i want a hundred percent chance even if that's only going to happen once every couple of years i think that's a safer bet what's wrong with him scarred oh that's not too bad um just to try and double down on genius we might even have to throw this kid in the river uh test the mystical practices yeah this worked out really well last time um continue the experiment oh no oh for god's sake um Right, that's okay. Uh, again, a minor setback. <laughs> ah. um, your wards get additional skills of becoming your, your friends, okay? Cultural fascination, that's a bit pointless. Faithful, clergy opinion, or anatomical studies. Core physicians cost us to hire, I feel like it's a fantastic, just first learning trait to get. Putting our husband on managed domain does give us... Oh, no. Don't you dare. Um, Henny? Uh, okay, we're going to have to bring you on. Help me, Beehive. Uh, do you know more than what is necessary? It's too late for caution. Is it too late for caution? Uh, what's our health? Fine. Got those dangerous habits, though. Go on, then. Do no more than what is necessary. Oh, for fuck's sake. No! <laughs> you can't kill another character this quickly. Ah, we lost straight ill. We're fine. Um, boring Betty is being boring and shitty. Right here. I'm going to educate you. Um, I'm gonna actually remember to educate this kid this time. 70% chance of saving a soldier. 300 lifestyle experience. Oh, there we are. Save the life today. Fantastic. Wow, that was actually a lot there. Holy shit. Um, embrace celibacy. Never gonna happen. Wash your hands or carefree. I think we'll go wash your hands first. Let's try and keep our people alive because we are not doing well on the, on, on the, on the, the, the kind of lifespan RNG here. It's, it's screwing us massively and we've got to be a bit more careful with it. Wow, music, please. 
I like to be able to hear myself think sometimes. As rare as that is. Hey, there we go. Okay, chance at the genius child. That's all we need, really. Genius child, good learning experience. We've got to get somehow, eventually, p possessed into the picture. And if we just get that that lifestyle, uh, that that um wise man trait, we're good. Like we are set for life. Perfect little daughter. How perfect? Not very perfect. No, not very perfect at all. Um, im in in perfect. Im in perfect. In perfect. Oh God. Uh, female name beginning with I. 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 Guana. <laughs> that is what you call a human females, is it not? Not a huge amount going on right now, and I'm kind of debating whether or not we should go to war. Um, I'm still waiting for the control to be over our provinces so that we've got enough levies to really warrant going to war. But I feel like if we leave it too long, look, we've already got House Alarm forming there. Neighboring ruler, this idiot. Our stepfather. No, he's not. He's just a, a randomer now. I don't even know who this man is. Yeah, see, that's not ideal. That should be us right there. So I think we need to cut him off before he gets out of hand. Because if he takes this province here, that's it. Like, we're done. We can only expand up through the, the through the Sahara at that point. So I think we need to take you out, don't we? 6-4-3 versus our... Oh, man. We could do it. Allies? Oh, no, we couldn't with his bloody allies taken into account, could we? Similar. We do have allies, too. We're allied to, like, our brother or something like that. This guy down here. Um, Drifton Bowo of Rano. Um, but if we're fast, what are we going for, though? We want to go for Zama? It's quite sizable compared to us, isn't it? What about air? We're trying to take out air. Is that a single? It's two provinces. Okay. Um, that seems a bit more manageable. And it would just be free land, essentially. I think we're going to do that. Inferior. Yeah, I think that's a safe bet. Right, let's bring you up to here. We are conquering air, my friends. We're not conquering air, my friends. That said, we were going to win that. You lying, stinky game. What do you mean there's some element of randomness to it? Surely not. Okay, our champion died. That was why we uh, so we got absolutely clapped there. Right, we might as well put that... Uh, oh, thank you. Um, I was going to say we might as well put that martial skill that we got from the spirits to good use, huh? As long as we can take this, we're good. Like, the war is the war is over there and then. Might as well just sit on this, because they're not going to bring their troops back if they've just wandered out of their own territory. Come on. Come on. 68. Okay, if we can take this one, the war is definitely over. I'm just worried they might walk all the way around. I genuinely think they might. There's no way in the hell they're going to do any damage before we've won this, though, surely. Oh, here they come. Nah, it's over. We're good. Okay, that was quite lucky, I will admit. We got very unlucky with our commander dying in that battle, but that wasn't... Two t oh, no. Okay, it's only 149, guys. We're okay. We're okay. Nothing to worry about. Get in there. Kill him dead. Look at this. This is why they call her Kayla Karen. Point in the direction and she slays. Right, give me some uh, iron constitution. That'll do. Yeah. Oh, again, all the health we can get, please, brother. That's all I really care about right now. Um, if we recruit you to court, you are 60, so you are basically dead and mummified at this point. Um, eight stewardship? Oh, God. Oh, God, you were also a marshal. Okay, I'd rather you, have you do marshal, marshal things. Oh, this is a sorry sight, isn't it? Wow. What a tragic council. So carefree. I'm going to save restraint until last because restraint is crap. And we obviously aren't going to use it. So um, without kindness, the world falls apart. Absolutely incorrect. Um, compassionate or arrogant? That's not ideal either. Or we beat the child. Give her callous. Dread gain, tyranny gain, dread decay, attraction, opinion, close family opinion, but intrigue plus two. Yeah, what are we training you in right now? Oh, good lord. Okay, martial it is then. Um, what does compassionate give? Diplomacy, we lose intrigue. It's the opposite of callous, fair enough. Um, arrogant. Opinion of liege, opinion of vassals. Opinion of liege, opinion of vassals. There's nothing wrong with that. That just gives us prestige, and our character thinks less of our vassals and, and, and their liege, but that's not a problem. Sinful to Boris. Oh, bollocks. That is a problem. Um, okay. Uh, spit on him. Beat him. He deserves nothing less. Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. That seems reasonable. What about Kokor? Uh, 871. I think I think if we're going to go for him, now's a good time, right? Let's get, let's get in there. We need, to, we need to cut off this expansion of House of Land, because they are seriously getting out of control. Um... So let's just conquer, conquer the duchy. What's that? 375. Ooh, that's not bad. Um, conquer a whole bloody duchy. That would save us some dollar, wouldn't it? I might save up for that. Uh, save up in, 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 the, in the prestige sense. Um, then we can just save money on not having to form the title. Let's get these guys out of here. Actually, give me some money then. 
We, we might just be able to afford the title anyway after we've ransomed all these people out, to be fair. There we go. Very nice. 162. Oh, you know what? We're going to be bloody close, aren't we? Or was it 150? Honestly, I honestly don't remember. Not that we de desperately need to be duped for any particular reason, other than the fact that obviously it's the right direction to go in. Yeah, it's 125. Wow. Um, all right. Done. We are now a mighty Magajir. Excellent work. That's that's something. But you know what? And in fact, we've got a hefty amount of... Oh. We've got a hefty amount of prestige now. Um, how many troops you got? 1,900. Bornu have grabbed some land there, which we could always pick up. Uh, this is a difficult one. Do we want to go for the big duchy up here? Hive Chieftain of Kor Kor. Uh, I think that's probably the best. Oh, we can't. We're not illustrious, are we? Bollocks. Um, well, we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. I said that with the last character. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to just take this random county off of you then, if that's all right. We're looking for Chieftain of one of these. Hang on. That one right there. That's what I meant. Thank you. Different religion? It was piety. Oh, same religion. That probably explains why it was piety in hindsight. Oh, hello. And we have Kano, hostile. Kano? Oh, they're also after that, are they? Bollocks. Oh, god damn it. Chieftain of Bornu. Okay, that's quite annoying. Um, don't worry about it too much. Let them do the siege, then we'll just swoop in and take it after they've got out of there. Or they've just disappeared. Appeared. Oh, they actually con no, they're conquesting this way. Oh, that's fine then. That's not a problem at all. If anything, they've kind of done us a favor by knocking their armies down, keeping their defenses nice and low. And now we can. You see them sneak out of there? You can't do that. Shoot him or something. Chase him. Get him. He's running so fast. He's like lightning. Okay. Oh, you think he's going to head that way? I get the strangest feeling. Alright, it's going this way now. But keep chasing. Keep chasing. Never stop. God, why are they so fast? What's his capital? Uh. Where, where is your capital, brother? Uh, show me. Oh, I've just answered that question fairly simply, I think. Um, okay, just do a load of siege and then sod it. Oh, don't do sieging. Oh, they're so strong. Oh, what happened to all the troops that the other guy killed? Well, they're there, evidently. Well, obviously not those ones. They're alive. Oh, well, that sucks. Um, sorry, my husband died. That was very selfish of him. How'd he die? Was it in a battle, perchance? Slaying battle. Tragic. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we've got to take whatever commanders we can, okay? I know that it's going to lower their life expectancy, but it's either that or we sit here and watch House of Land blob out of control. And I'm not, not up for that. I might white piece this one, just because we're now out of commanders as well. 75 prestige. That's a small price to pay until we can kind of rebuild ourselves a little bit here. Um, Boring back keeps Alice fine. That's, that's okay. Not a problem. We lost our father as well. Jesus. Um, all right, fine. Oh, that was a critical break. Probably because our husband and our father died. And then we dared to assign someone as our... <laughs> as our diplomat. Unthinkable. Right. Time to be men's breaks plus three years. Yeah, give me that. Right, okay. Um, hashish or reclusive? Uh, I think we'll go for this one. And just not partake right now. Thank you, fella. Why is our stewardship so low? Probably because our husband died in hindsight. Okay. Um, God, is this really what we've got to pick from? God, what a sad bunch. Okay. I mean, you've got handsome. Or we could go for the alliance power, which would be incredible. But obviously, going matrimonial in the alliance is, is very difficult. Um, due to my you, oh, it's better than nothing, though, isn't it? Is it? <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. Um... This guy's also got claims, to be fair. Go on, then. Matrilineal. We've, we've got something that way. So we've got an alliance with this guy. 880 troops. Hey, that's not bad. That could have won us that last war. Okay, do you want athletic or journaler? Um, Athletic's quite good. What does journaler do? Learning plus one. Um, The, the health boost, though, is, is quite nice. Keep stacking those health bonuses as much as possible. Athletic, medicine, iron constitution as well. Okay, it's, it's coming together. Hopefully we'll play as this character for more than 10 years this time. Oh, this is a real mess. House of Land Civil War. Okay. Um, And who are we helping here? So it's two vassals inside that ram fighting. Uh, yikes, what a mess. We're helping Rano. Wow, this is a real mess, isn't it? Good God, I have no idea what's going on with these politics. Okay, I'm just going to siege whatever has a flamey banner. I do a good job, mother. Did I help with the war? Um, okay, let's go this way. Mustering grounds. That's really helpful. Uh, restraint then. 
Garbage. Know thyself. When death and touch causes one year where you receive a warning, I thought you did anyway. Um, healthy. Medium boost. That's fantastic, because that's not even a countering one. And then we get a hollow body, which is just more more health. We're going to be... I, I always feel like this is the best first, first one to go for if you're going learning, because it just gives you so many more opportunities to take everything else. Really loving this mechanic where recruiting new knights to our court is making us stressed constantly. New courtiers constantly. Fucking hell. Okay, there you go. Enjoy that. That's just going to give us more friggin' negatives. Um, save up, save up. Yeah, save up. Unite Africa. Whoa, is that actually an option? Oh, look at that. Uh, Torres the Africa. Okay. Um, completely control the region of Africa. Whoa, I guess that's kind of our end goal. Someone's come to unite the African peoples under Bori. Yeah, that, that is the end goal of this campaign. Oh, cool. I didn't realize there was actually a decision for it, though. Warren became a skilled tactician and a reaver. I can't complain about that. Especially when we actually have the opportunity to raid. Now, our stats are pretty poor, I will admit. But, I mean, our education is... Oh, there we go. That's a bit better. Um, our education's not too bad. Arrogant is a little annoying, but that's not a big deal. That's quite nice, though. It means that raiding potentially could be useful. Give it a little bit of time. Uh, let, let all this come out together. What the fuck are you doing? Get out! Hey! That's what I thought. Genuinely think the easiest way up now is swear fealty to house or land, take his throne. Um, the old-fashioned way. By which I mean fabricate a claim uh, using the intrigue tab, kidnap him using the intrigue tab, and then push it while he's about to go into your prison, and then obviously take the whole thing. Uh, that's never failed us in the past, and you know what? Tempted to go for it this time, too. Okay, that would that would make us a decent size, wouldn't it? And then we could really start snowballing, and then it would only be up to basically Ghana to stop us at that point. I could deal with that. Okay, we need an intrigue character now, and I've just made a bunch of bloody martial characters because I thought we'd be fighting tooth and nail for a little while longer. I right, start bloody raiding us now. Sod this, right? We're going to swear fealty for the simple reason that we can now swallow up this round relatively safely. I'd rather be fighting people with 610 dudes than, than you know, whatever he had before we swore fealty to him. This makes our lives a lot easier. We do need Cassus Pele. Not really a problem in CK3, given that it's quite literally just a countdown timer, so that's always fine. Um... What should we start then? Maybe go for Kebby first, because they're relatively weak. They're right on our border too. We'll try and fabricate claims on. I guess I guess we'll just go province to province, right? Because obviously we can't push multiple claims quite yet. Learning was definitely the wrong call uh, in this situation. What would have been a good situation would have been learning at the top level when you're the emperor, because then you can just kind of keep a nice stable realm, just kind of kick around with a lifestyle focus, go for the really high. Um, go for, go for the really high health boosts as well, and just kind of, kind of meander really around as an emperor in in decent safety. Um, grow closer to forming a a friendship with our liege. Yeah, I'm all right with that. He's trying to sway us then. Oh, I haven't got a problem with that at all. Um, healthy, medium boost. There we are. I feel like I should probably address the fact I know that I'm five out of two on domain size as well. Um, I'm not quite that sleep deprived yet. I, I'm I'm waiting for this guy to turn 16. We'll marry him. We'll get the stewardship from that. Then we put him on stewardship focus. Again, chance I will be able to hold all these titles. Um, and we'll actually get some bloody troops back and some opinion and everything. Basically, we get everything back. Oh my god. Hello. What's it? Raised? No, I'm not doing that. Hello. I'm not doing that either. Hello. I feel like this is all the same man. Um, oh, while well, the game was not very happy about that one, that's all right. What, what, when's your birthday, husband? Uh, 17th of September. Oh, next month. Fantastic. Then we should be able to hold all our titles and everything should be good as new. Five out of two. Bollocks. Um, oh, we actually have to marry him first. Ah, classic. There we go. Right, five out of three. That's a start. Um, so we'll probably have to give away one of them here, but that's alright. And then we'll set you to... Oh god, you're already set to manage domain. Oh, that's frightening. Uh... Shit. Swap you out. Hey, I'll swap these two over. There we are. How about now? Five out of three. Oh god. Okay. Um... I'll give away this one, because we've got low county control up there anyway, and I don't have enough time to be... Let's give it to our door, sir. That's a good idea. You take that. Uh, four out of three. What else we got here? Um, low county control buildings. That's got five holding slots. What about you? You've got. You've also got five slots as well. So is that one? Let's give away you then. Um, grant to family members. We got any family members at all? Can we see a uh, relationship? Nope. Apparently not. Um, that's not a big deal. Your daughter and vassal. Give it both to our daughter. Fine. Give it in the family. Absolutely okay with that. Got Chieftain of Chieftain of Kebby and the Chieftain of Diamara. Uh, that's the one that we went to war for and obviously lost, so that's fine. Um, 300, 320 troops. My god, we are going to destroy you, tiny child. Get roasted. 
Oh. <laughs> I expected far more than that. And I'm so thoroughly disappointed. Well, we still should win. Um, unless I really, royally fuck this up. Why are you moving so fast? Rolling around at the speed of sound. Right, get over there. Take his capital. We're good. This, this is going to be an easy war. Because they're not going to they're not gonna do any damage up there. Not enough soldiers. Bollocks. This is not going to be an easy war. Right, there we go. Now we can actually... No! Fuck! We started sieging them. We attrition down. Bollocks. Well, look. They're not going to be able to do anything. They can't stop us at this point. We've just got to... Oh, skill tactician and reckless. Okay. So we've got two relatively bad commanders to choose from there. Fantastic. Right. So now we've got to beat the holding before attrition beats us. Uh, hello. What's a discreet council to offer me a fertility treatment? Oh, good lord. Okay, go on then. What is it? Uh, a simple tincture seems sensible. I don't know what that is. Uh, successful fertility treatment for 10 years. 91% chance. The future of the Ramses at stake. I'll try anything. Uh, we might gain amazing fertility treatment. Uh... I think that one seems fine. 10% fertility. Yeah, go on then. Here's one of those. No! Oh, you... Oh, this game. Oh, this game. If I right-click on a friggin' message, obviously I want to close the message and not move my troops into the friggin' Sahara. Dune. Come on. 95%, you son of a bitch. Right, okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Just got to take this one, and then we've definitely, definitely... Oh, we're good. Okay, thank you. Right, this was definitely the right play, I think, moving into their, moving into their realm. Um, let's give that away to someone. Uh, my daughter, you can have more shit on your plate. There you go. Not literally, obviously. Well, I, I won't shame her. Um, right, what do we got here? Go on a pilgrimage. See the aid of the spirits. That's always fantastic to do. We might get strong. 75 gold. Well, there goes our next claim money, basically. But we can probably ransom some people out. On the subject of next claim, let's get to work. Come on. It was a strange feeling. Wind spirits blessing. Intrigue and dread gain. Oh, I don't want the bloody wind spirits. I want the spirits of strong, muscly man. I want the natty spirits, brother. Whole of body. Right, what does that do? Fertility 20%. Health medium boost. Minus 20% stress gain. Big fan of that. What's our health looking like now? Invincible, basically. Athletic. Whole of body. Healthy. Medicine focused. Iron constitution. And... She smokes the cure-all itself, that's right. A little bit cucumber paste. And another bloody lonely lifestyle, that was fast. Right, do you want to go to pet, 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 pet the doggy? Or scientific? Um, what's going to distrust because it can become your friends? Faithful. Clergy opinion plus 10. Oh, this is all a bit shit. Um, scholar, what does that give us? Hostile scheme success, personal scheme success. That's actually quite good. Um, sanction loopholes can buy claims. That's quite nice. 20% of your primary... Oh, that's nice. Wow. 20% of your... Chancellor's primary skills are added to your own. Yikes. Um, learning per level of devotion. Different faith opinion. That's a bit pointless. Uh, although that's very, very good for when we get to the late game of this campaign, huh? Wow. Faith conversion cost minus 75%. No, no, that's to convert to other faiths. No, that's the opposite of what we want. Bad. Evil. Um, what have we got over here? I don't really care about religious relations right now. Um, I feel like, if anything, I'll just go for that one and then we'll hop focus for a while. I'm thinking wealth. We could definitely do with some gold. And I think gold and obligations, we just stick a guy in the capital and we just start farming up gold. Kella Karen, next claim. 96, 96 bloody gold. Okay, well, that's fine. Look, we're on the wealth focus. You know what that means? <gasps> oh, I was going to say genius son, Abby Backer. Uh, I'm going to call you. I'm going to call you Awful Allen. Awful Allen. Of 75 prestige, that was obviously quite nice. What have we got so far? A boring Betty. Uh, Imperfect Iguana. <laughs> and then Awful Alan. Brilliant. This is really going swimmingly, isn't it? Landed two of our daughters there as well. Let's make sure the other daughter gets some land to try and even things out here. But the reason I'm doing that is because we're Dynasty Head. So they are basically uh, indebted to us uh, via the medium of their blood. Which sounds a lot cooler than it is. But basically they just owe us in, in wars. Um, you're in debt. Low county control. That's a fair point, isn't it? Um, already on it. Well... Too fast. Sold some cattle. We have 50 gold. That means we can go to war. Um, hello. Oh, hang on. Hello. Oh, Christ. No, no, no. We don't want to look at you. Uh, hello. What have you got? No. Fuck off, game. Work with me here. Right, that's what I want to see. Um, 631. How are we looking on our realm? Oh, we still need to reinforce. We still need to get a bit more control over the realm, too. Look at our maximum levy size going up there. That's quite nice. We, well, look, let's hold out for a bit. We're not that desperate to go war to war to war. She's going to live basically forever. She's unstoppable at this point. So we could really start working on the next claim instead. 
Um, well, our levies are in force, I think. There it is. Golden obligations. Right, let's see. Have I got any hooks and secrets? Nothing yet. Emphasis on the yet. Let's get you uh, in. Garnon capital? Ooh, that could be powerful. Where is that? Orca. Okay, let's get you in there. See what you can dig up. That's pretty decently fast. That's actually not bad at all. Sid Sidiba. Oh, short Sidiba. Well, I guess we found... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Guess we found that one. That one was easy, huh? Short Sibida. Damn it. These kids are, are just atrocious, aren't they? To say that... Oh, hang on. I, it was the first husband that we married for geniusness. Well, of course we're not going to get any bloody genius kids when we got this ass. This absolute Darwinist nightmare of a man. This gout-ridden, filthy, concubine-birthed, melancholic idiot. This rapacious absolver. I don't even know what either of those words mean in that order. All of Kebby will be mine. Wow. Uh, that's a lot of land. That's like three provinces, two of which I've already got a fucking claim on. Uh, <laughs> there's no, there's nothing there. Like, we can't find bloody anything. Uh, it's a problem with these rounds being pretty decently small. But Ghana looks big. I remember these are large provinces in Ghana. Um, I'm Ghana. Send you somewhere else then. <laughs> right. Please find me some secrets. For God's sake, don't tell me I wasted a whole point on golden obligations. Didn't get anything to show for it. Ooh, you naughty boy. Right, there we go. Boom. And, excuse me, brother. I'd like a payment. Oh, we can. Okay. Because um, we're house head, we can force that person to pay us. Because we're house head, we can put, force you to pay us as well. That's incredible. And because you are a dirty diddler, we can take literally all of your earthly possessions. 75 gold. That's what we're after right there. Kebby, 113 fellas versus our mighty 728 fellas. I think we need to start working on a bloody man at arms regiment, don't we? Uh, prestige base. It's a hell horseman. Wow. Hello. Uh, Mantuaras use light coated armor and javelins to devastate their enemies. What, how do they compare to regular light horsemen? They are absolutely identical, but they've got some terrain bonuses. Oasis, desert, floodplains, and dry lands. Oh, that's actually good. Wow. Okay, give me some Sahel horsemen then. That's incredible for here. So we're going for two Sahel horsemen, a line of pikemen, and a line of heavy infantry. Um, if there's anything, we will find it. Trust me, my friend. Right, let's go for... Tax woman. Uh, it's a bit pointless, isn't it? Meritocracy is really nice, but maybe not right now. Um, you six extort subjects, war profiteer. Yeah, let's go for war profiteer. Break, scrape back a little bit of gold there. Right, okay. I think we're ready to go. How many troops are we looking at now, then? 1128. That's a lot better, isn't it? Uh, 514. So, I'll, I've decided I'm going to take your entire duchy, if that's okay. Um, our objective is the entire duchy. Just wanted to double check. Boom, let's do it. This should be a walk in the park. No... Oh. Hello. Did you hire mercenaries, you naughty boy? 733 friggin' mercenaries. That was against the rules. Um, well, you know what? You can play that game. Oh, God, no, they can't. <laughs> oh, no, they cannot. Um... Do you think our boys could take them either way? Do think we could do it? Surely we've got better troop type. Oh, I don't know. This seems risky. Best commander? Uh, let's just take a look. She's there. Reckless, flexible leader. So basically, we're putting it in RNG. We could get very lucky. Let's see if we can meet them in our territory. Give ourselves time to reinforce. Let them siege the troops down. Look at this. Look at this. See? This is good. Now move in. Potential battle. You will probably win. Better army commander, more army traits, higher quality. That's what we like to see. Get in there, kill them dead. Slay them. Oh, phenomenal. 75% already. What a what a guy. Okay, let's head over. Take this. Come on. Grab this and this war will be done instantly. Come on, come on, come on. Told you. Oh, ho, ho, brother, that's a lot of land for us. Oh, look at that. We now make up half of House of Land. That is incredible. Thank you. Uh, you're now my vassal, and I imagine you're not best pleased about that at all, are you? No, I don't think you would be. Um, hello. It's me, your friend. Wants to see on the council. What are you good at? Learning and uh, words. Whatever that's called. Chancelloring. Yeah, that. Diplomacy. That's the word. <laughs> the irony isn't lost. Uh, what have we got here? Steward. Right, we've got a better steward. We have not got a better steward. Um... Shit, we got to be careful having so many non-vassals on our council. Let's get you on there. 13 opinion, that'll do. Um, swap you out for a vassal? No. 
Not willingly. Although you're better anyway, so I'm going to sack you if that's okay. Um, so we've got a steward is not a vassal. We'll lose 10 points of stewardship. Oh, I can't. Can I? No. Go for her. Then we only lose 7 points of stewardship. Alright. Go on then. Uh, right, okay. We've got a vassal there. Oh god, this is not going to work. Steward and vassal. Put, okay, put her back there. That's a better idea. Forget about swapping anyone else out. Marshall. Uh, your daughter, sister-in-law. Your daughter, sister-in-law, and heir. That's frightening. Um, you've asked with one point. Brother, you are not, you're not getting anything. I'm sorry. You can't. You're so bad. Let's take some payments then. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 271 gold. That'll do it. Uh, kind of pilgrimage if we really feel like it now. Um, do we want to? Oh, we need to go into some stress, certainly. So I think what we'll do is instead we'll have a feast. Um, not in stress since you're shy. We won't do that. What I meant by that is we'll have a hunt. Uh, because, you know, shy people, famous for hunting. Uh, I'll mount a turn on my wall, gain a hunting trophy, or be a trophy for my daughter. Sod that. My walls never look better. So on to bigger and better things. Oh my god, all of Katsina too. Wow, that would be big. 538 dudes, what have we got? 1,594, you're making it too easy for me. We're, we're already getting to that snowball level. I'm so glad that I've redeemed this. I, I will admit, at the start of the episode, I was like, I'm, they're going to hate me. I've, I've fucked it up already. I've fucked it up twice. Because bearing in mind the other one where I didn't say the right succession law. But you know what? I'm pleased with this. If we can, if we can pull this one off, which, you know, I think is pretty much hopefully guaranteed. Um, this is, this is great. Because then we control basically all of House of Land, which was basically our first goal anyway. But yeah, look at this. Ripping it apart. 96%. We could just wait for Ticking War score, to be fair. Um... Which probably come through and probably before we finish this siege. No, or not. Wow, there we go. All right, so now we control basically all of the realm. All of House of Land is ours besides the actual kingdom level title, which sucks, but nothing we can do really. Um, we also seem to be, we're in the middle of a war for like this province over here. So I'm not really getting involved too much, to be honest, because I don't really care. Um, and inviting new champions to court because we're shy, obviously is a pain in the ass. But we'll do what we can to help out because I'm just that good of vassal. Such a nice vassal. Why am I doing this? <laughs> Why am I doing this, he says, with uh, the entire kingdom in the course of about two years. Boring Betty, what happened? She was 35? She was 35? I thought you only just finished your education, Boring Betty. Wow. <gasps> your granddaughter killer Karen is your heir. Yeah, she is. Uh, can I edit her? Uh, editor? No, that's not what I meant. Educate. Can't. Offer guardianship. Yes. Uh, me. To you. And she'll accept. That's fantastic. Killer Karen the second. Be educated. Oh, <gasps> Iguana died as well. Dead in battle. I, I assume they're commanders then. We should really stop. Let's drop these troops. I'm, I'm being too nice of asshole here. Oh, not drop them, but just get them out of there. We actually helped out with that war massively. So you, you're welcome, by the way, liege. Hey, uh, do some push-ups. Forget about your dead daughters. Incredible. Works a charm. Uh, follow it up with some tasty cakes. There we go. Excellent. What, uh, sorry, who? What daughters? I don't have any daughters. Spymaster. Welcome aboard. Nephew and vassal. Oh, that's a good combo. Um, so now we've got to figure out how to get this man's throne. Uh, unfortunately, there's no real way to do that besides going independent and then pressing claims after the fact. Uh, similar, really? You think so? I suppose we... Uh, allies? No, we, we are... Se oh, 417 mercenary. Wait for this war to end. Wait for him to exhaust the rest of his troops. Then we'll just swoop in and take him out because we're not going to have our troops raised, are we? And then we're going to absolutely destroy him. Right, there we go. Um, if he drops his... Get rid of your mercenaries. Oh, it's a three-year contract, right? Let's wait for those to disappear, and then we'll just we'll just kill him. Or we could go from now while he's weak. 1569. 1983. Apparently, that's including some of our troops as well. I think we're going to go for independence, and then we're going to take this final title. So let's go ahead and start fabricating immediately on that. Um, and then rally point down to here. Let's go ahead and raise all, and then start moving straight away. That's what we like to see. Wow. Holy shit, that's good. He's moving 600 troops out of that. You are done for, my friend. Uh, content, fickle, or trusting? We'll give him fickle. That's okay. Oh, God. Um, what are they have in my pocket than her yet? Whatever. 36%. Right. If we can catch his troops. Holy shit, get independence too. That would be nice. That means that we, 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 we swore fealty, took everything, and then got independence all in the same, in the same character. What a step up from her mother, huh? 
who just whose most impressive feat was uh dying. It's his six. Come on. Come on, come on, grab this one. Come on. Before that before their bloody troops come in. See it done. There's the claim. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Been attacked by I thought I said China then for a second. I was gonna say bloody how they've gone out of their way, haven't they? Right, done. Independence is ours. Now all we need is to actually take his title here. We should be able to assert the Kingdom of Houseland then, right? Or is that included in that? Um, yeah, we, we can definitely assert the title after that. Oh, incredible. Right, so that's all that we need. Bring them home. Drop the troops. We've got to wait for the troops to expire. So tomorrow, guaranteed kingdom. No question about it. What are you doing here? I'll put down conquest for the chief to... No, 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 no. I didn't agree to this. Get the fuck out of here. You come in my realm trying to take my things. Duo pandas. Get out of here. What's the reason you're going extinct? Boom, look at that. Uh, 81 gold, too. That's quite nice. Pay for our claim. Well, that'll definitely do for today now. Can't, can't drag it out any longer. Let's go ahead and drop these troops. What a, what a turnaround, though, huh? Dying in the first episode of Final War to getting everything and independence. That's a nice combo. Four out of three. We've got a bit of uh, management to do. We've got to obviously dish out our, our lifestyle perks. We've got to sort out council. Whatever else. You know, basic stuff there. Pretty happy. That's, that's not a bad turnaround to say that can barely string a sentence together right now. Thank you all for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed this one. And thank you guys out to our executive producers of today, including... Look at that list. My God, that is ridiculous. I still need to do scrolling credits at some point. Thank you to Steak and Bacon Akins, Bok Bin, CJ, Siala, Alchemia, Jobo Daddy, Dumgear, Oromab, Magos Adamandios, Aromatic Fool, Gogola, Siphon, Arctic Knight, Gibbering Mound, Voodoo Mumbo, Danzy Mordekane, T-Bag Crew, C-Mac, and everyone else at the executive producer tiers over on coffee a big thank you to those guys for making the channel possible in the first place and a thank you as well to blue chaos zaka kq the magic velociraptor trevor brooks Cyric 313 corrupt racer hazel kg evans matteo electric alice carsten vuoxa telcus 345 jack black sheep and you at home for watching this what was a mess but i feel like i'm slowly redeeming it